Hi everyone, and welcome to Tech Solutions Hub YouTube channel. It's, your friend and technology instructor, Tech Wizard, and this channel is passionate about helping people who are blind or visually impaired to live more independent and fulfilling lives through technology by sharing and uploading the latest news and updates on technology for the blind. From time to time, you will be hearing different voices on the channel who will be covering everything from new assistive devices to accessible apps and softwares. This personalities will also be sharing tips and tricks on how to use technology to your advantage. We will be so glad if you can subscribe to the channel. I hope you'll find our videos helpful and informative. Please feel free to leave comments, share the videos, and suggest topics for future videos. Together, we can make technology more accessible for everyone. Hello, welcome to another edition of our lessons. Today, we are going to be demonstrating with an app called Insta Reader. What is Insta Reader? Insta Reader is not just an app for reading. It does much more than just an app for reading. One, you can upload books on Insta Reader. Secondly, you can convert badly written PDF books into a better PDF book, more like re editing it. Though Insta Reader is an online reading app, you have to be online before you can use it as in your data needs to be on because it uses data to be able to flip pages and to be able to do this converting then you can start from whatever page you like it continues from where you stopped reading so it goes beyond just an app for reading so insta reader is a very very nice application and it does not just read your PDF books, it reads some other types of books, more like an audiobook player. It plays your audio, just like Leger Reader does. All you need to do is to click on it, and you can play your audios that have been stored on the application. So that's Insta Reader for you. Now we are going to find out how we can use Insta Reader. I'm going to open my file manager right now. File manager plus three of five on the dock. File manager plus. Okay, I'm actually on a particular book that is badly written. And how do I know it's badly written? You might want to ask. I have more than one reading app on my phone. I have about three or four different reading applications on my phone. I didn't save one particular reading app as my default reader. I like to choose what I want to use in reading my book, so I left it the way it is. So now let's look for the book I want to use. St. Mary dot PDF five hundred thirty nine kilobytes, April twenty third, two thousand twenty three. So this is the book I want to use. St. Mary dot PDF. It's in PDF format. Mind you, Insta Reader cannot read EPUB. That's the distinction between Insta Reader and the other type of readers like Lige Reader. So Insta Reader don't read in EPUB, but it reads in PDF. And I think there's another file extension it also reads. But let's focus on PDF books right now. I'm going to be focusing on how you can read your bad written PDF. I'm going to use this Saint Mary.pdf because this Saint Mary is not written in a way that one can understand it using the normal apps like Voice Allowed Reader and 
one or two other apps like the PDF viewer can't read it straight but in StarTrader we read everything now I'm going to click on it open with and it will ask me open with it's asking me for the app which I want to use in opening the book so let's swipe forward open with drive PDF viewer drive PDF viewer it's a Google Drive PDF reader so let's click on the drive PDF viewer to see if it will read it well file manager plus drop page 1 of 58 zoom 107 percent this book has 58 pages that's why you can hear it say page 1 of 58 and you can say zoom now let's try and let me put my finger on the face of the screen and start reading 21 slash 04 133 p.m. plus 233544142 Ini asterisk Saint Marie asterisk episode 1 Marie's mom's out city observing her daughter who had been sick and pretending to be well she examined her from head to toe focusing Marie on her belly am I just focused on what I'm thinking I hope Marie is not pregnant to clear her doubt Mary rushed to the back I are committing uncontrollably it is finished Mary has gilded and shook the horror resounding slap from behind and began punching her somebody help help Mary shouted some neighbors who heard her screaming grin out Madam Cecilia I want to kill her only off the neighbors how is trying hard to separate out of the mother of angrily Mary and Soon as her mother lose a grip of her, Marisma was panting for the lie Asherain had curses in her. As I have an asset to discourse him, Mary, y'all will bet his grace don't ever think of coming to. The shows a continuing Madame Cecilia becoming down now. Why are you always shouting and beating this girl? What a shot on at this time, Marie had the friend to read a jet pregnant under my roof. If you noticed, you can hear some words and you can, you can <laughs> hear nothing as well. It's, it's blabbing like um a barbarian that is because of the way the book was written and now it can be re-edited but we come to that it's 58 pages one good thing about insta reader is that when you reconvert this book it will remain 58 pages it will be giving you something like 24 pages or something lesser it will give you lesser pages there by making you just uh, save data it will be lighter once it's converted and it will have every character that is on that book everything will still be present so it will have it well converted that you can still use the same apps you are using so this pdf viewer is reading it like this and that's the way voice aloud reader and some other apps like that will still read it but i know voice dream reader wouldn't read it that way so now let's close the book back button file manager plus st mary dot pdf 539 kilobytes april 23rd 2023 so it's now focused on that same book st mary any book you write it will come with a file extension either dot pdf or dot doc depending on the file extension so this is a pdf book that's why it says st mary dot pdf and we are going to click on this book again and it's still going to bring out the options like i said i love to choose what i want to use in reading a particular book depending on how lengthy or how light the book is and the good thing about insta reader just like i said is that it has a last memory once you click on it you will definitely go back to the exact spot you stopped if you continue reading that is in case you want to do anything you can decide to pause or you can decide to close the book close the app itself even though you like turn off your phone for five days six days turn it on and go back to insta reader click it open and you will definitely continue from that exact location you stopped so like i said we've just closed it and we're going to reopen it and it's going to ask me to choose what file i want to use open with open with now i'm going to swipe to insta reader remember we used pdf viewer open with drive pdf viewer drive pdf viewer was what we used earlier so we are going to swipe to insta reader icon button reader reader this is leger reader i don't want to use leger i want to move again icon button insta reader insta reader that is what i want to use now let me click on the insta reader insta reader 
choose pages okay before it reads it will ask you to choose pages uh-huh it will ask you to choose presents a box where you can choose the page you the pages you want it to read that is another unique thing about insta reader so let's move forward one from page text box it asks you one is it if you want it to start from page one it's presenting a text box area for it or an edit field where you can decide to start reading from 58 to page text box 58 the highest page is 58 pages so let's move on okay so i don't want to choose any page i want you to read the book as a whole book i want it to start from the very beginning so i swipe to ok and click on it so it should say processing ordinarily processing page one okay you heard that so before we continue i would like to add that insta reader is an audio book reader but you can as well read it in braille it works like kibo it also works like leger reader it's an audio reader but you can still read it if you want to read with your fingers or you want to read from page to page it's possible so having said that we are going to load saint mary into the instant reader remember i used drive pdf viewer before and the result it brought out wasn't really that okay so i'm going to swipe until i get to instant reader now open with insta reader so i'm going to open it with instant reader now and then you guys will hear it reading well before you hear it reading it will present a box asking if you want to start from a particular page so you can edit and type where you want to start from so let's click on it. insta reader insta reader now i believe it's presenting the box let me touch the face of the screen choose pages okay it's asking you to choose pages what set of pages do you want to read do you want to read everything or you want to choose from one page to the other if you want to start reading it from page four or page five for instance once you type the name of the page here you would swipe to ok and click on it and it should start reading from that exact page so but i want us to start from the very beginning of the book itself from the very beginning of the file so i will swipe to ok one from page 58 to page one from page text box that one from page text box you can type the page you want it to start from then 58 to page text box there are 58 pages on this book so if you want it to stop at 30 this is where you type your 30 it's a text box you can clear the 58 and put 30 there so swipe back again one from page text box one from page text box there's a text box you can start typing you just double tap on it and your edit field will come up and you start typing you clean what's there if there's anything there but there's nothing there so just type the page you want it to start from you want it to start from page five type five here then swipe again 58 to page text box 58 to page text box here you can double tap open your edit field and then clear that 58 and type either 20 or 19 that is where you want it to stop reading from in case that's what you want but i want us to start reading from the very beginning of the book so let me swipe to okay okay click on it processing page one see processing page one it's processing now page one 2104 tilde e tilde e saint mary episode one mary's mum sat outside observing her daughter who had been sick and pretending to be well she examined her from head to toe focusing more on her belly. Um I just hope is not what I'm thinking, I hope Mary is not pregnant. To clear her doubt Mary rushed to the backyard vomiting uncontrollably. 
It is finished, Mary has killed me, she gave her a resounding slap from behind and began punching her. Somebody help, help me, Mary shouted, some neighbors who heard her screaming ran out. Madam Cecilia you want to kill her? One of the neighbors who was trying hard to separate them uttered angrily. Mary ran as soon as her mother loose grip of her. Mary's mom was panting heavily as she rained curses on her. As you have decided to disgrace me, Mary, you will be disgraced. Don't ever think of coming to this house continue running. Madam Cecilia be calming down now, why are you always shouting and beating this girl, what has she done this time? Mary had the effrontery to get pregnant under my roof. Page 2. I think any time I'm correcting her, you people always side her. You people Back will be given her morale, now she has proved her waywardness. Now, I just stopped it, it's on page 2 now, it has the ability to mention the page it stopped. And now, as I've gone backwards using the back button, I will swipe and we we'll see what it says. Confirm. It will say confirm. Do you want to save this audio book to read later? I swiped again. It's asking, do you want to save this audio book to read later? Okay, let's imagine I want to save it to read it later. So let's move forward. Yes button. I want to click yes. I swipe to yes button. So I click it. And so when I clicked, let's swipe forward. St. Mary, enter audiobook name text box. Editing. It will give you another edit box where you should enter audiobook name. Don't forget it's an audio reader. But you can still be following up by touching the screen and it will still be reading what you are touching. But I prefer to read it and enjoy it through the audio play mode. So let's move forward. Save button. Now I've swiped to save button because I don't want to change the name of the book. You can change it here. Yeah, it presents that. Saint Mary, enter audio book name text box. You can click. You can open your edit field and clean up the Saint Mary if you want to use another name to save it. Or bear in mind that if you clean this Saint Mary now, probably you want to use. Charlie Chaplin to save this uh, particular audio. It will come as Charlie Chaplin. That means the original name has been removed. So I want to leave it the way it is. I swipe to save button and click on it. New notification from Insta Reader audio book name already exists. Try again with different name. If there's a book like that there already, it will tell you it already exists. I have opened this before and that's why the book is still there. So if I have to put a name to differentiate, I will simply ha have to put something on the edit field. So let's write there. Audiobook name already exists. St. Mary, enter audiobook name text box. Editing. So let me just put two. Two. Mary. Two. Two. So let's see what is calling it. St. Mary 2. Enter audiobook name text box. So that too will make it different. No, I believe it should make a difference. Save button. So I swipe backwards twice and then I'm going to click on the save button. It should save now. My audio New notification from Insta Reader audiobook saved. So you can hear it. It's saved. It's saved up right now. So what are we going to do? We are going to move forward. Menu button. Swipe. My audio books. Menu button. Okay, let's try and even explore the menu. So. Change app display language Accessibility button. volume 60. Insta reader version 3. 1, 2. Insta reader premium button. Insta reader version 3. 1, 2. We are on the menu. And it's giving us the different versions. Insta reader premium button. There is premium button. Help. Help. How to use app button. How to use app. Contact us button. Then the email of the developer is here too. General. There is general settings. Preferences button. Preferences is there. TTS and voice settings button. You have your TTS and voice setting. I am using Google TTS. As you guys can see, I'm using Google TTS. You can use a different TTS to read any book you want to read. 
I prefer using Google TTS to read my books on Insta Reader. Change app display language button. Here you can change the app display of your language. I don't come here. My account button. Then the account, you have to sign in. I think you just got to sign in before you can use it. This is an online book reader. Report button or provide feedback button. So here yeah, is talking about how you can report bug or provide feedback. I don't come to these places. Privacy policy button. Privacy policy. Share Play Store download link of Insta Reader button. So you can share the Play Store link from this area. Rate Insta Reader on Play Store button. And you can rate it on Play Store from this particular option. Close button. And you can close it. So I'm going to go back. And before I go back, one thing about Insta Reader is every setting explains itself. So you don't have to start explaining. Like if you go into general, for general. instance. Let's click on preferences. Preferences button. Under preferences, we, we just clicked on it. Preferences. Dark theme switch off. Here it's talking about the theme. Read automatically switch on. Read automatically. Here you can decide to toggle it off or on. If you toggle it off, it will not read once it finishes loading. So you leave it like this. If you are the type that wants it to start reading immediately after it has finished loading the first page then you leave this on access audiobook current page text with screen reader switch on so you leave it on let's go back read automatically switch on and go forward again access audiobook current page text with screen reader switch on so it's switched on then swipe again continue audiobook reading when switching app or screen turned off switch on continue audiobook when switching app or screen leave it the way it is i have never tampered with this before so it's just the way it is by default processing sound switch off processing sound is switched off so it's turned off because if you turn it on it will be making a sound while the book is processing to come on process complete indicator sound switch on process complete indicator leave it this way switched on by default except when you just want to explore it and as long as you know what you are doing it's okay so when you open insta reader you first see a menu button and then you click on that menu button and from there it presents you with a list of menu that you need to know on the app insta reader version 3 1 2 when you swipe forward, it first gives you the version. Insta Reader Premium button. And it gives you a premium button. I don't come here. Help. There's a help button. How to use app button. It tells this part tells you how to use the app. So it's self-explanatory. If you click on this, you should know how to use the app. Contact us button. Then there's the contact button of the developer. General. Yes, general. Preferences button. So let's click on preferences. Back button. Preferences. Dark theme switch off. So this dark theme switched off. Leave it this way. Read automatically switch on. Read automatically. This has to do with the book reading. Immediately it finished processing. So it starts reading. Access audio book current page text with screen reader switch on. So if you turn off this it will not give you the page number again that's what it does if you turn it off it will not give you that page number continue audiobook reading when switching app or screen turned off switch on so this is switched on leave it this way processing sound switch off processing sound leave it this way process complete indicator sound switch on this tells you that the book has finished processing or the page has finished processing. Page processing voice update switch on. Pre page processing voice update. I think it tells you that the book has finished processing. I think it does the same thing with the other one. Page turn sound switch on. Page turn sound. Yes, this one has to do with how it flips. How the page is flipping as you are reading you know when you are reading a book it reads it as if it's a human 
been reading so you'll be hearing the flipping of the pages so that is what this does i love my own you can decide to turn yours off back button so that is the last you have there menu button my audiobooks search your audiobooks but create new audio read saint mary 2 audiobook one more options button so after each book you see a more option button after each book you are going to see a more option button so let's click on the more option and what do you have on the more option download audiobook button it you can download the audiobook again and it will correct this type of book now that i started reading it will correct it now making the pages smaller it shrinks the pages so it's no more 58 pages it will now go down share audio book button you can share it and once you are sharing it it can it gives you different formats through which you can share delete audio book button so you can delete from here you can delete this audio book close button and then you can close it okay we will be stopping here this is the first part of this demo on insta reader we would want to continue the second part and on part two we'll be showing you how to convert a book using insta reader so that's what we'll be doing next so we have to wrap up the show here and uh, it's nice being your guest here on this particular demo version so we continue this demo it was quite long you have to know some preferences and some other things on easter reader thanks for being there i, I catch, catch you guys, guys on, on part two. Part two.